G'day. I uh, just had a... Sorry, don't have my movie jacket on. I'll put it inside. Add a quick idea. I was just patting my cat outside, and I came to the realisation, which I suppose I had before, that cat's fur is soft. Very soft. What we could do is go to the RSPCA, buy all the cats, buy all the cats from all the RSPCAs, and have a cat farm. Let them grow, uh, let them live to a ripe old age of maybe 15, 16. Fatten them up while they're living, so give them extensive amounts of food, just cheap food, just normal food, and have, make it into a cat petting zoo. So children can come in and yeah, stroke the cat, the old kid cat, oh, I love you, yeah, cute, cute, all that stuff. And when it gets to that age, quiet injection, just let it die after not feeding it for a little bit. Not feeding it for a little bit, let its skin sag a bit, then when you kill it, take off its fur. After all, you have, so, uh, you have saved this cat from a lethal injection from the RSPCA, it's the Royal Society for the Protection and Care of Animals, for all those other people who don't have an RSPCA and might have an ASPCA, or if you're in America, um, an RSPCA, well, I think that's everywhere in the Commonwealth. But anyway, um, you could take these furs that you've taken off the cats, and you yeah, sew them all together so that you can finally have fur cats again, or fur coats again. And yes, fur is murder, and doing it this way is still murder because it's a pretty little creature. And you know what? I agree with you. Fur is murder. But what the RSPCA is doing and giving them a lethal injection, that's murder too. At least this way, we're giving the cats a nice old life. They get petted and played with, and then you turn them into furred coats. And wouldn't it be great if you kill those cats? They're really soft. A fur coat made from that sort of fur would just be magnificent.